Today's my first day in Magic Kingdom in two years. I'm so excited. Welcome back to Let's Find Fun. Today we're in Magic Kingdom. It's my first time in Magic Kingdom in two years. I'm super excited. Um, we're gonna do all the things. Carousel of Progress, Casey's Corner, Big Thunder Mountain. Let's go. Tomorrowland, but I wanted to give you guys an update. So the reason why I haven't been here in two years, even though we live less than 10 minutes from here, is right before our annual passes expired, we had a 14-day trip to Morocco, and that trip was kind of expensive, so I was like, yeah, let's not renew. But So we didn't renew, and then COVID happened. And now APs have been MIA for the last year and a half. So that's why it's been two years since I've been here. And Corey is staring at me. Hey Disney, if you could start selling annual passes again, that would be great. It would make living, you know, 10 minutes from here a little bit better. <laughs> Thank you. First thing of the day, carousel progress. If you know, you know. It's our fave. And inside for 20 minutes. Yes, AC. How long has it been since we've been on the people mover? A long time. We're really glad it's back open. We are super excited for Tron. It looks amazing. Now we're headed to It's a Small World because I think we're about to get a quick storm. So we don't want to be standing out in the middle of it. Um, hopefully it'll cool it down a little bit here. World has always been one of my favorite rides here in Magic Kingdom. It's just so classic. Like they have one in every single park. You know, the Walt, it was the Walt's original idea. I love the animatronics and the slow moving boat ride and just all those things. It's just like a classic ride that you have to do when you come. And I love the song, not even gonna lie, but it's the best. So we are about to ride the river boat. We have never ridden this before. As many times as we've been to the Magic Kingdom, we always skip it because usually you're running around trying to get on all the rides, but um, they all have pretty long wait times right now and we are tired of standing. So we found a nice little seat to sit on <laughs> and we're gonna ride the boat. <laughs> okay, bye. Cue the B-roll. <laughs> I mean, did you really come to Magic Kingdom if you didn't do Country Bear Jamboree? It's such a classic. You can't skip it. You could, but John really loves this one, so we're gonna do it. I mean, I've only been watching this since I was like five, so we can't skip it. Aloha Isle, where they have the Dole Whips. So it's like a special float. This is actually coconut. 
soft serve and then it has pineapple juice and like blue syrup and then that is a chocolate cake pop with a little cockamore face it's so cute this is my sister taylor's favorite treat here in magic kingdom so i got this in her honor but i realized that i um uh, didn't grab a spoon so we gotta go get a spoon mm -hmm. for that exact reason help it's really good though all right so we got the spring rolls that are over by the entrance to Adventureland. Um, we got the one of each, the cheeseburger and the buffalo chicken. Don't actually know which one is which, so I'm just gonna try it. They're warm. Oh, definitely cheeseburger because that's a pickle. <laughs> Pretty good. I don't know what this sauce is. You think this is the, oh, this is probably for the burger. It smells like mayonnaise. Delish. John's favorite. Ah. That's pretty good. It was like more inside than I thought there was going to be. Try the buffalo. Buffalo chicken. Hmm. Kind of tastes like buffalo chicken dip, you know, when you make it in the crock pot. That's what it tastes like inside. It's good. Still think it's a little pricey for for ten dollars, but it's not bad. Nice little snack. You want to try them down? We went to the Emporium. We just wanted to see what they had that was new. Um, and then we decided to jump in the Starbucks line because it wasn't super long. Um, I tried something that I have been wanting to try purely for the aesthetics, and that is the pink drink. Let me know if you've tried it before. It's pretty good. I think it's literally just like coconut and strawberries. So I don't, it's delicious and it's pretty. And then John went a little more hard and just got plain black iced coffee but I'm definitely gonna have some because it's time for caffeine oh it hurts a little bit he should have got oat milk so we're kind of running out of things to do the lines are pretty long uh, Big Thunder was like 50 minutes, Splash Mountain was like 75, Dumbo is 15, so we're gonna jump on Dumbo, probably run over and do the tea party because it was 15, and then maybe go do some more eating because it's lots of fun, fun slash lots of fun food, so, and then fireworks, and then go home and go to bed for like 10 years. Sounds like a plan. Sounds like a plan. <laughs> Take me a few bites to actually get to the, the good part of it. All right, so we're finally to the dog chili and the cheese bar. Honestly, it's pretty standard. There's something super special about this. You come to Casey's Corner for the corn dog nuggets, but yeah, see, those are crispy golden brown. But this, it's just a lot of food, so I usually get it. It's good, especially after like a hot, hard day. All right guys, so that's the end of the vlog. Thank you for watching, we really appreciate it. It was a great day, it was magical. Uh, we rode some rides, got some delicious food, but that's it. So like if you like the video, comment down below what's your favorite ride in Magic Kingdom, and subscribe if you wanna see more content like this. Next week, we are headed to East Orlando to eat at some new restaurants and share some delicious food with you. So you might wanna stick around until then, but we will see you in the next one. 
Instagram for fireworks. We're staying to watch happily yes. ever after. We'll have fireworks after this, so don't click out. <laughs>